The wedding day arrives, but alas, without the bride. Of course, we've come for the Hydrian, and you've gone to such lengths to prepare. Merely my duty. Ah, but for an outsider to lead the Imperial Army must be a battle in and of itself. You've spoken to Lady Luna Freya. No. That obstinate secretary, standing in the way, while you rush off to slay the Hydrian for your poor sister's sake. I know the price of the Covenant. You know, I've always wanted to go sailing like this. Not many opportunities living in insomnia. Out here, it's just us and the horizon. It's amazing. It's life-changing. We've quite a ways to go until we reach Altisha, so keep gushing to your heart's content. When we step off the boat, we'll be in a foreign country. The anticipation alone is a foreign sensation. Then to think this is where we were headed to begin with. We've been through a lot. And there's still more to come. So next on the docket is Leviathan. What sort of deity are we dealing with? A serpent said to embody the roar and rage of the sea. We'll have to see for ourselves. Can't let Lady Luna Freya do all the heavy lifting. You must be so psyched to see her. Luna? Yeah. Well, we need to make sure she's all right before anything else. Indeed. Her well-being is top priority. Don't like this going down on Imperial turf. You think Lady Lunafreya is in danger there? The Empire did invade Lucis for the ring. I have no faith their ruthless ambitions will stop short of harming the Oracle. Without the ring, the crystal's no more than a rock. Hmm. I suppose. Does anyone know how Lady Lunafreya came to have the ring? It seems likely His Majesty entrusted it to her safekeeping back at the Crown City. So she's held on to it this whole time. All the way to Altitia. The ring is important, and so is Leviathan. But Luna comes first. You know, I was thinking back to our encounter with Ravis. Hmm. Do you recall an apparatus in place of his arm? Yeah, I remember. Seems he lost his old one in the invasion. But in its place, he seems to have acquired new power. Power? That would help explain how a son of Tenebrae suddenly came to command Niflheim's army. Now that you mention it, his strength did seem sort of supernatural. I just chalked it up to the Oracle lineage. His ancestry may be part of it, but that alone wouldn't account for his freakish strength. I wonder what could have happened to him. There's a disturbing rumor about Lord Ravus has taken to brandishing His Majesty's sword. My dad's. Then what's the big idea behind that? That his power's the same as the power of kings? I cannot say for sure. But I have my doubts. Ravis wears the sword, yet doesn't wield it. <laughs> For all his newfound powers, he's still the Chancellor's lapdog, holding on to the enemy king's sword like some badge of honor. It might help if we knew what he was after. I can say. What are the odds the Empire will crash the pool party with Leviathan? Consider it a guarantee. They failed a god to prevent Noct from receiving his blessing. They'll do so again. But we beat him to the big guy. Thanks to our friendly guide. Never know which way that one's gonna move next. The Chancellor has an agenda all his own. Sometimes it helps. Like when he called off his army and let us escape. But he was still a creep about it. Well, it feels like he's only helping us because he wants something. I just don't know what. Reckon we'll see him again? Certainly hope not. Not your type? No love lost for phonies. As Gladio said. His actions are motivated not by altruism, but by self-interest. And when he does come to our aid, I see only condescension in his eyes. Yeah, can't argue with that. Ever think you think too much? Sometimes, but it's always preferable to the alternative. So, soon you'll have your old man's ring back. Yeah, when we arrive in Altitia. Good thing. To him, it was his heritage. Is that what my dad said? Carrying a royal line ain't a task to be taken lightly. For a small thing, that ring can sure weigh heavy. 
After he became king, I only ever saw his face in the paper. Wait, weren't you at the coronation? No, I, I was long gone from the city. You must have been invited at least. Had a fallen out of sorts with your old man. Right at the end of the trip. You did? I was given to understand you stayed in touch. We buried the hatchet years later, but never talked face to face again. Should have paid a visit while I had the chance. Well, no use dwelling on it now. Got the regalia in the hold, but you're all gonna stay in Altitia for a good while, right? Yes, we believe so. In that case, I'll tune her up for y'all. Not that I'll have much to do, though. <laughs> well, with Cindy looking after the old girl. If you say she's good, she must be great. She was never afraid of hard work. Heaven knows she had a hard childhood. A hard childhood? He means her parents. Lost them both when she was little. It was big enough to understand, though. And to hurt. But you wouldn't guess that, seeing her now. Not at all. She's always so cheerful. Well, that ought to tell you how far she's come. Well, you must have seen your fair share of Altisha by now. Yeah, only done been the once. Stayed a good while, though. What's it like? Big old city. Big, okay. Well, it ain't the crown city. Different. Got it. We'll see for yourself. Foreign lands seldom lend themselves to trite explanations. Change the scenery ought to do you good. Well, I'm all talked out. Can't be far to Altisha now, right? We'll be there in no time. Nice having the wind at our backs. Logic is our first order of business. All work and no play makes sickness a dull boy. Someone has to babysit you too. Well, you're welcome to sleep in the wild. Ain't no hotel, but I know a fella has a place. Hey now. Westcombe ran with Reggie and me way back when. Oh, was he the other one in that photo with the garage? Yeah, runs himself a diner or a cafe or something. Go and see for yourselves. Sure. Does the place have a name? McGee or Magoo or uh, Mago. That's the one. Nice. You can count on Old West, but <laughs> he'll chew your ears off. The government issued a statement promising that the reasons behind awakening the Hydrian would be clarified in the ceremonial address. Got a signal. Delivering the address will be Lady Luna Freya, who was previously reported dead. This will mark her first public appearance since the violence that befell the signing ceremony. Lady Luna Freya's gonna give a speech? Sounds like it. Lord knows. This world could use some wisdom. Won't be much longer now, Noct. Yeah. Okay, it said that I could skip it, but I didn't want to skip it. I want to hear like, like, uh, like the uh, like uh, kid his uh, story why he like, well he had like a fallout with the father. And this place looks kind of beautiful. Holy shit! This risky as hell with the boat. Only one lane. <laughs> Holy shit! This person has to be like really really good with the boat. If there was a storm, the boat would accept the way. Does this vessel have an entry permit? Uh, entry permit? Relax, I got one. Here. That's as old as they get. Seems in order, you may pass. Holy Prepare shit. Advance. Could say that. 30 odd years ago. That's what the guy meant by old. Lucky us, huh? That could have ended badly. My god, this. Holy shit! Can I move? No, I cannot move. It's like the whole place is. Yeah, it looks like the whole town is in water. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, look at those tiny little boats! <laughs> Well, they're fucking small. Yeah. 
Phew! Finally back on land. Yeah, barely. They call it the Walls of Water. But it ain't just the walls. It's the whole damn city. Which is why we can't traverse the town by conventional means. We'll need to rely on gondolas instead. Yay! More boats. Hey, not huh? this. Catch. Uh, oh. Key to the boat. What? Don't you want to go sailing again? Are you sure? Why not? Old girl ought to be sturdy enough. Not even an awful driver like Reggie could sink her. A king can't rule with wisdom alone. He needs perspective. So get out there and see the world, you hear? Sin has given you the key to the royal vessel, but you had you are not able to go sailing at this time. All right, I have to do the main quest, and later on I could do the fucking uh, oh <laughs> holy shit! Wait, I gotta check. Ascension. Is this where the ship is in, or the car? Yeah, the car. Is there one with the boat? <laughs> You're experience a long trip in the car. Let's see. Double item with the Gladius survival skill. Getting experience catching fish. Double the item uh, from fishing. Take photos. Wait, what is that? Take photos in battle. Up to five can be saved. Deplete the tech bar by one. Triple the idols gained from fishing. Extend status books. Oh, I thought it was going to be the boat. For winning the chocobo race. Okay, there's no nothing about the boat. Let's see, uh, oh, let me check what's going on here. Exploring the water, the one day gondola tour takes in the major attraction at Telsa and it includes the stop of Arena uh, Galvano. When you could try our hands to the to uh, Tomostoro, same day's res reservation accepted. What's next? Immigration? What do you mean? There's still more? Oh, 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 what, what, what we have here? Hello, sir! Sir, Wh what is the purpose of your visit? Purpose, uh... Uh, what's my choice? Uh... Ask Ignis. Ignis, a little help? <sighs> Utterly hopeless. We are scholars of the culinary arts, and we've come to study the renowned cuisine of your fair nation. Is that so? I wish you an enlightening stay. Another one you owe me. That yeah, sounds like convincing. Like, he's, he's being sarcastic right there. I should have said uh, Sid, say it. You want to check Wescombe's place out? Yeah, let's all go to Mago. Perhaps we'll even make it in time for tea. And we'd better start looking now. Mago. How about the cafe in the brochure? So, we're looking for the guy from the picture. An estranged friend of the king. Oh, Nox, oh. you ever meet him? Nope. It's the fourth guy. Say it with the flower. Includes the card to make sure they get to the message. Let's take a look inside. All right. <clears throat> I want to give a message. God damn it. Million gill question. What are we eating? So we're going to talk to the fourth guy. I I was wondering where the hell he was. Want to prove the love to her? Give the gift to the uh, glitter forever. Ask about our custom engagement and wedding ring. Mounting. Now I see why people flock from far. <gasps> They're extending the exhibit for Lady Lunafreya's wedding dress! <gasps> the Vivian Westwood? But wasn't that a memorial for her passing? Well, now it's a memorial for her safe return! Let's go see it while we still can! Oh, could that be the dress we read about in the papers? Doubtless. The designer's name is the same. Wanna check it out? That depends on the groom. Might still be a sore spot. What with his wedding getting called off. Who says we can't call it back on? It can still happen. True enough. Let's keep an eye out for it. 
symbol of peace. See the wedding dress on display. Yeah, I want to see it. What could it be? Hey, well, let's, let's see the quest. Should be like the last part. Yeah, there it is. Symbol of peace. Where the fuck are you? I don't know, know where you are. Uh, it doesn't show. He just stood there, staring at the church and looking all sad. Can you blame him? His sister was supposed to get married there. But he knew what was going to happen that day. He could have at least warned her. Well, what if he wanted to but couldn't? He must be eating him up inside. <clears throat> oh, he's talking about his brother. He's talking about the brother. Oh, Luna Freya. How about the what cafe could the sure. wedding dress be? Is it inside there? We got like two muscle heads right there. Never mind, it's not they're not guarding the door. I thought they were guarding the door. His arm's so cool. I mean, not like I actually want one of my own or anything. No, dude. I totally feel the same way. They say that things got like superpowers. The Empire makes some sick stuff. Okay. Where is this wedding dress? I wanna see it. Is it in there? Can I go in there? Nope. Wait, it could be in here. Or it's just like a whole yeah, it's a hotel. Or it could be in here. Come on. Nope. Let's go see the dress. Oh, let me look up the nearest stop. It's not far. We can walk it. Sounds like we're close. Okay, we're close. We're close. Okay. I'm starved. This wedding dress is supposed to be like all like outstanding. I wanna see how it looks like it. Like if you know. Gondola. Care for a ride? Give me a sec. Let me check the map. Holy shit, we could check the whole place here. Holy shit. What could the wedding dress be? We could like go all over the place. <laughs> Where's the wedding dress? How about right a ride -a on the gondola? Up here? You never know. Is this this way to the dress? Yep. Same street as the estate. Seems we're on the right track. Okay, it's here. It's right here. Let's see this wedding dress. Uh now where? <laughs> now we're going here? Let's follow this. Maybe I'm going the wrong way. Yep, I went the wrong way. <clears throat> see, wedding dress, wedding dress. I think I just followed that. Nope. In here? Well, there's a guard here. It could be the place. What the fuck is that? Oh. Inventory full. I need to fire. Right. Uh, where am I in the wrong place? Wedding dress. Wedding dress. She doesn't rub shoulders with the Empire by choice. Everybody knows she wants independence. Maybe she can ally herself with the prince now that he's come back to life. Wait, is that why she went to Mago? Oh my gosh, that Wescom guy's from Insomnia too. You don't think the prince is here, do you? See that over there? What about it? So what next? What? <laughs> oh, what are you checking? Again, the Galato made with the wine from Flavor of the Day. Is... Where is the goddamn wedding dress? Oh, the dress is so beautiful. I want mine to be like that. And it shall be, my love, as surely as I am your Prince Noctis. <laughs> Looks like the Prince has a following as well. Not bad. For a symbol of the peace. There it is. There it is. One hell of a crowd. 
And that's the dress. My word. Everyone looks so happy. And it's all because of this one dress. Yeah. Real glad for you that Lady Luna Freya is safe and sound. Yeah. Well, that settles it. You gotta make it happen. Become a symbol of the peace. After we tie up all the loose ends, let's think about the ceremony. A fine idea. Yeah, I'll think about it. How about the cafe in the brochure? Alright, uh... Let's do the main quest now. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, it's right here. Shit, I should have followed the main quest. Is it in here? Uh, where the hell is it? Uh, it's, it says it's down. God damn it. Is it down there somewhere? What's a good place to stay? I'm trying to find where the fuck is this place. This is down there. Wait, maybe I have to go here. Is this a restricted area? I, I, I'm not sure. It looked like restricted. Is it down here? It could, yeah, I think it's down here. This is kind of creepy. Hello? There's like a giant picture here. Evening already? Time flies when you're having fun. Huh? That, why the fuck is there a giant picture out of in out of nowhere? No one goes in there. <laughs> hey, what no. the shit? I gotta find like another level. Uh. How do I go down there? Here, I have to go in there. I, I, I need a boat. Yup, I need a boat. Shit. Hello there, sir. You gotta take me to the splendid. <laughs> Where are we off to? You gotta take me to the Mongol, whatever. Uh. Street station. Is it here? Gentlemen, it has been a pleasure. How the fuck are you in there? Can I get in the water? No, I cannot get in the water. I need to go in there, damn it! How the fuck I go in there? What's that name? It is quite lovely. Search twilight. for the Western yeah, Bar. But there's something lonely about it too. The Western Bar. So, care to take a cruise? See, uh... Is it this one? It could be that one, I, I don't know. Skip. Wait, no, maybe they can talk. Maybe they talk. Do they talk? They're not talking. I was hoping they talk about something. Yeah, I think I got the right one. I got the right one. I got the right one. Let's talk to this guy. This, the fourth member. Shop till you drop. You gonna stop? Fantastic. There we Call go. Call when you need a ride back. Welcome to Accordo Lads. Sid mentioned you'd be dropping in. Weskamarma, as you've gathered. My word, you've grown, little prince. Hmm. Ah, but of course. <laughs> you were only a babe at the time. Now I see why people flock from... So this is your maiden visit. Enjoying it so far? You doubtless have many questions, so ask away. This country is a part of the Empire, isn't it? Oh, you're wary. I understand. But there's no need to jump at every shadow. Just be aware that the terms of our independence grant the Empire free reign to come and go as they please. We'll bear that in mind. 
It's admittedly a one-sided arrangement. Most everything we do requires Niflheim's permission. And they wouldn't knowingly permit the Oracle to appear before the public. How our government spun that is quite a mystery. You really think Luna will make an address? If every recent radio broadcast is to be trusted, absolutely. Where is Lady Luna Freya? In the city somewhere. But no one has caught so much as a glimpse of her. The media has been conspicuous in its silence on the matter, which speaks volumes of government intervention. That certainly explained the rumors of disgruntled Imperial officers leaving the city. Has anything changed with Leviathan? For now, it's business as usual at port. But word is the government will soon open the altar of the Tide Mother. In preparation for the right. Ah, but on the other hand, they're scrambling to stockpile emergency provisions. This begs the question. If they're anticipating that the Hydrian will wreak havoc, why would they allow the right to proceed? Do you see lots of nifs around here? We do, sometimes even at my place. Theirs is a familiar presence, and the citizens don't think much of it. Though the High Commander did cause a stir when he showed up the other day. Ravis. So soon after they fell the Archean and Lucis, his arrival fuels rumors that they will next come to Altisha. The Empire's not content ruling all the land. They want the heavens as well. Well, if you need anything else, you know where to find me. Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, my dear Camellia, it's been a while. I heard about your distinguished guests. Ah, you've an ear for gossip. Hello, man. You look like you're kind of pissed. Gentlemen, I won't waste your time. My name is Camellia Clostra. First Secretary of the Accordo Protectorate. You should know, we have Lady Luna Freya in our care. And the Empire demands we surrender her. What? Yet I am loath to acquiesce unless we stand to profit. Hence I've come to discuss terms with the King of Lucis. If you've a mind to talk, come to my estate. She can be oblique at the best of times, but I assure you, her heart is in the right place. Oh, okay. At any rate, you must be weary from your journey. Might I suggest you seek your beds for now and ponder matters anew in the morning? Yeah, I think we'll do just that. Let's grab a bite. I don't know. Splendid. She Where are we off to? She might like wants like a reward or something. Like I don't know, like maybe the, the Empire is like telling him that they will give her this if you give her Luna Freya. She like wanna see who gives her gives her the best offer. Gentlemen, it has been a pleasure. Go to bed. Have a look at this, Noct. What about it? Whoa, 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 what's going on? Whoa. Oh, we already saw this. Touring the town, they, they used the famous Galados. Experience the city in the sea the way it meant to be. How about a Rydala on the gondola? Oh, gondola. Shit. All right. Let's go. How much this place gonna cost, you motherfuckers? One of the places costs like fucking 5,000. Wow. Oh. This place is so romantic. Then you get to enjoy it with us. All three of us. What the you fuck? You are a lucky man. It's the messenger. Gentiana. Ahead lies a future uncertain, yet sure is the astral memory, wherein the king may walk. No, um, Umbro's power. You can now re uh, revisit past memories. Summon him when you rest at the log. 
characters will retain their current level and abilities. Rental chocobos will automatically return to the post. The place you call Umbra will set at your last rest point. Past memories. You can now sail to the open seas in a royal vessel. Board, uh, board the boat from the Galadin and Kui. Cape Kayam and Atelshi. So I could return to past memories? Like, last missions? Yeah, well, uh, let me rest. How much does this place cost? Greetings. Okay, it's good enough. <laughs> good enough. Hey, this one's pretty good. I know. I dig it yeah. too. I like that. Oh. I like that too. Let's see. I swear what? half your photos are selfies. What the? Hashtag sorry not sorry. <laughs> this fucking eyes look like he's a murderer. Let's see, uh You two are the picture of friendship. That's Luna Freya's wedding. He looks kinda sad. I I like this guy. I, I see him. I don't know about her. She she looks she sounded like me she sounded mean. 